front where it says aims real big. Well, it's just a beautiful day here in the good old town of Millville, Pennsylvania. Just such an incredibly beautiful, rainy, cloudy, gloomy day at 40 degrees outside on the second day of May. It's making me want to put my Christmas decorations back up and start listening to Christmas music again because this I shouldn't be wearing this in May. Like, like two months ago, that was fine. I, we've, I even would have accepted a little bit of April, but once spring hit, that meant winter was supposed to shut off and be done. Like, no more. We sprung forward so hard back in March, it's winter again. Anyway, I know it's going to be nicer later this week, as a matter of fact. It's going to be in the 70s come Saturday. And for once, we might actually have some sun on the weekend. I can't believe that. It's rare. It's normally sunny and warm on a Monday, Tuesday. Usually every weekday, it'll be sunny and warmer. And then just in time for the weekend, Friday afternoon, come 4 or 5 o'clock, guess what? Cold front comes through, bringing all the rain and gloominess and making it all nice and miserable and cold all weekend long. Well, that's usually what happens anyway. Anyway, what the heck am I ranting about that for? We have summer goodies to look out here in the Family Dollar here in Lower Millville. Uh, you might remember a long time ago, I did a pair of videos here uh, right before they renovated it. And then after they renovated it a while later because I just didn't think to do it no matter how many times I came down here. It's one of the nicer Family Dollars out there because I've been in some that are hurting. But this one's pretty good. It usually is. But... I want to see what they have for summer 2023 and show you guys. I have to stop in here and get a few things for the house anyway. So what the heck? Let's go take a look and see what they have and get out of this rain before it turns into snow. Because it's actually supposed to tonight when it goes down to 36. Anyway, let's go in there and dream. Only dream about swimming and barbecuing and being outdoors and getting bit by mosquitoes and... All the other fun things you do out there in the outdoors, in the non-snowy, rainy conditions. I mean, a summer, a summer thunderstorm would be fun. All right, let's go in there and check it out. We'll start off with all the patriotic stuff that they have here. I love the decor. I guess you put a candle in this. Oh, that already has a candle in it, and I already broke it. The little battery lid came off. That's cool, a little metal lantern, it's five dollars, has a little LED candle in there. That's very cool, and they have a white and red one as well. I'm not even in the store. Five seconds, and I'm already breaking stuff. Anyway, I put that back up there, but their other tabletop decor is cool, especially the stuff that says America with the little fireworks and stars, and I saw this, it's only three dollars? God bless America, they have it in red and blue. Home sweet home. These are cool. I actually really like these. I like the stars. I like how they're like 3D too. For $3, I think I'm gonna grab one. I'm just wondering which one I wanna get. Ooh, home sweet home. God bless America. Hmm. I don't know. So upon picking up the first one, I discovered that it says God bless America on one side and on the other side it says home sweet home. So now I don't have to pick and choose. I get the best of both worlds. And we should probably keep it on the God bless America side because Lord knows there needs to be a lot of blessing in our world these days. Anyway, moving on. They have wall decor and I especially love the one that says boom on a rocket. You know I like fireworks. You know I like things that go boom. <laughs> The map, the country map, the American flag, it's a palette. It's made to look like a palette, and then they have sparklers and poppets. More tabletop decor here. It's pretty cool, and they have American flags here as well. Try and stand it up a little bit. They're all kind of falling over. There, at least I got them to stand upright somewhat. They got smoke balls, and then they have patriotic doormats too. Gnome of the Brave, oh my gosh, the gnome things. That one has a truck on it. Very cool. They have glow sticks, lots of glow sticks, and then next to that is pole stuff. Outdoorsy, 
water, fun. They have all kinds of floats. I like the French fr fries float. Do they have any others besides that? A big popsicle. Yeah, Jurassic World. Goggles, sunscreen, definitely need sunscreen. Look at that, the duck float, a tire float. What's that? What's that supposed to be, a cookie? <laughs> yeah, but they have all different kinds of pole goodies. Outdoor goodies here, little kid poles. Slightly bigger ones here. Not bad. Before we go into the aisle with all the main summer stuff here, I figured I'd show you this stuff over here. They have little solar, I think these are dogs and they have frog citronella candles. I actually have to buy one. I'm gonna wait until I can find something cool, even though that one's nice. I like that blue color. The buckets are cool too, but they have that. Fans, not bad for a small room or a small work area. Little kids' toll sets, more solar lights. Welcome spring. Sure doesn't feel like spring today. Okay, now we'll start off with the summer-themed jugs. I like the watermelon ones, and then they have ice cream and the one with the flamingos on it. Very cool. And they're like little pitchers here with a tap on it. They even have a big, wow, that's a big sport water bottle. Holy cow. Drink up. Keep going. Keep chugging. You got this. Almost there. You did it. Holy cow. <laughs> Other summer cups here. Life is sweet. Cool. So cool. One with the flamingos on it again. These cools are razzly dazzly, I guess you could say. Interesting. They have all kinds of cups in here, too. They have a lot of them to choose from. Little water bottles. I think they're all plastic, too. And these ones are metal. The steel tumblers, which help keep your drinks cold. Liquid motivation. Morning vibes. Dare to dream. What's this one say? Da, 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 da. It takes a minute. Reach for the stars. Very cool. Anyway, let's continue. Hello, summer. Yeah. Can it get here now? I'm tired of it feeling like it's December out. I, I almost want to put the Christmas decorations back up. Anyway. Window decor. Wall decor. Welcome. Spring. Spring. Nothing wrong with the spring stuff. It is still spring. Though it feels like Christmas time. more solar lights and they have flowers here these are those fake ones that you can put like at a cemetery or a little memorial anyway they have flowers and vases here little plants look at these little pineapples that's a goofy color for a pineapple but okay these yard stakes are cool the little garden stakes with the butterflies and the birds on them welcome Spring has sprung. It has, and we're going to be going into fall foliage again at this rate. It's 39 degrees out there, and it's supposed to snow tonight, and it's the second day of May. What in the heck is going on here? I like the flowers. They have a lot of them here, like I was showing you. Beach towels. All right. Now, I don't need any more beach towels, although this one's cool with the uh, sea turtles on it, and they're only $8. They have all different patterns. So I'm trying to do this without knocking them all down. Tie-dye. Hanging flowers. And then graduation will be coming. Congrats to the class of 2023. All kinds of graduation goodies. And I'm sure they'll get more as we get closer to the actual summer season. They have little grills too for $15. Little charcoal grills. Not bad. They're awfully small, but it's great for two people. I'd say maybe up to four people. A maximum if you cook a burger for each person then hot dogs after can fit a couple I know I could work my magic and get some food on there but this is pretty good for two people I would say they have seat cushions here too pretty soft not bad more cups here we go summer fun what are these like little food baskets more napkins plates little sippy cups table covers oh look at this little buffet cooler it's an inflatable buffet cooler you fill it with ice that's pretty cool you know i would do that and put that in the pool fill it with ice and beers <laughs> that's just me though but these are awesome i even have uh kitchen sets five piece kitchen set for six bucks comes with two pot holders two napkins and an oven mitt summer life summer fun very cool. And the uh, kitchen towels, too. I'd be curious to see what else is out there. Squeeze the day. Life is sweet. Now we get into what I'm talking about. Food. 
I have freeze pops, these uh, Tampico regular mixed freezer pops, all different flavors. I saw someone had a package of them up here. Ooh, they feel weird. Blue raspberry punch, tropical punch, citrus punch, kiwi strawberry punch. Very cool. And then just your regular one, island flavors. Okay. And then cupcakes and Twinkies. Atta boy. Patriotic edition. They look like regular Twinkies to me. It's just a different box. Now that, those are fun. They even have Skittles freezer pops, Sonic freezer pops. What's this? Ice slush fruit punch. What do you put that in the freezer, I guess? I'm guessing so. Airhead snow cone. Oh, do you just make snow cones out of these? Oh, you just freeze and squeeze and enjoy, okay. You put this on, yeah. Freeze, squeeze, and enjoy with a spoon. Oh, okay, that's cool. $1.25 for those Sunkiss smoothie bars. Cool. Strawberry peach uh, drink mix for like individual bottles, I think. Yeah. Into a bottle of water you get. How many do you get in here? Six. Okay. Skittles, freezer pops again. I guess these are juice. More. Oh, they got the uh, Warheads freezer pops. Apple juice, Powerade, Jolly Rancher, Pop Ice, and Hawaiian Punch Swell Strawberry Banana. That actually sounds pretty good. Uh, now, I just bought a bag of potting soils for $6. It was the Miracle Grow brand. They have some grilling items, they don't have a whole lot yet. Speaking of gardening, bam! More flowers. They have, have uh, gardening gloves, watering cans. Oh, I like this. So you could put a it's a hanging planter you can put plants in. What's this little guy back here? Flowers and garden. Welcome. Look at that little camper. That's cool. I guess it's supposed to be a birdhouse. Yeah, it is. Look at these little solar lanterns. They have black, gold, and white. More citronella candles. Complete grow, uh, grow kit for strawberries. Flower bulbs. Folding table. Folding table, 30 bucks ain't bad. More flowers. Here's some more of those uh, colorful wall decors like butterflies, flowers. Look at a little snail with a little snail on top of that. And this one's a planter. Frogs, flowers, more gardening equipment. Look at this little kid's uh, rake. They have little tools in here. There's shovels in there as well. More watering cans. Here's some charcoal smokers. There are more charcoal grills, and they even have the charcoal. Good. More solar lights. These ones are cool. Five dollars. They have a couple of flowers on them, two different colors. Dif or three, it looks like. Yeah, you get three different types on there. They even have the large ones back here. That one there. More tools, and this is all gardening stuff and some grilling accessories thrown in too. Like that. The flower wreath. Look at the compass. That's cool. Little stand for a planner. Now you have the planners here. The big pots for them here. Those ones are huge. Normally ten dollars. Those are five dollars on the end. Not bad. Ceramic planners. Oh, they're hanging ones too. Look at that. Cool. Speaking of hanging ones, this one's cool with the three little ones. Okay, everybody. Well, that's going to wrap it up for me. That was a fun little look in there. And unfortunately, as I was walking out the door with my hands full of the items I needed to buy, I saw the couple of things inside the store that I didn't get on camera, like the little spinny pinwheels, the colorful pinwheels like I had seen at a couple other places, like at Ollie's, the colorful pinwheels that uh, the wind will spin, and they had a big cage full of playground uh, kickballs and stuff. So, and even like those cheap uh, inflated ones that if you hit it just right with a thumbtack or on the edge of a stair, it'll pop. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. They're better than that. But yeah, they had playground balls in there and everything. So pretty cool. Sorry I didn't get those on camera. I didn't see them until I was walking out the door, like I said. But anyway, good assortment of summer goodies in there. Pretty cool to see all the neat items they had in there. All the uh, patriotic items were pretty cool. I was impressed, to be honest. So, not bad. Liked it. And, well, I got whatever I needed. And I got that little star, that 3D star thing. I'm going to hang that up as soon as I get home, which isn't very far. It's a whole five minutes or so. 
10 minutes to the house, something like that. Anyway, thanks for watching, everybody. I really appreciate it. If you enjoyed the video, you know what to do. And with that said, I'm taking off, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks again for watching. Take care and stay awesome. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.